Welcome back to my YouTube channel again today with me, Pap. So guys, today I will cook something really special. I will cook my favorite food. Why I call my favorite food, guys? Because this food always remember me to my parents because my mom always cook this food for me. So normally we cook this food on Chinese New Year, but sometime in the normal days. So if I feel like to eat kind of this food, I will request to my mom to cook it for me. So guys, I will cook fried fish, soy sauce with ginger. Before I start to cook everything, guys, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel and like the video. You can give me a thumbs up if you like the content I bring it for you guys today. So, before I start to show you and cook everything, need to count one, two, three. So I will turn back the camera and show you the ingredients I already have prepared, guys. One, two, three. So here I have three pieces of chili, six pieces of garlic, seven times of ginger, and one pieces of Holland onion oil called white onion. All the ingredients you need to slice it. Also, guys, you need uh fish meat. This is already filleted, so you can buy a snapper or triple fish, something like some kind of fish like not really soft and hard. Also guys, here I have 1 tablespoon sesame oil, 1 tablespoon soy sauce, 2 tablespoon sugar, 1 half teaspoon salt. Also here I have 1 tablespoon oyster sauce. Also here I have a little bit black pepper and salt. So guys, before we cook the fish, I mean we fry the fish, we need to uh, put a little bit black pepper, salt, and we mix it. After that, we rest the fish meat for 5 minutes before we fry it. Let's start to fry the fish. So guys, you need to fry the fish until dry and a little bit crispy. And this is how the fish look like. So dry and a little bit crispy. Don't fry it too crispy because you need to keep the fish a little bit greasy. So after that guys, just take off the fish because it's already cooked enough. The next step is we need to fry the all ingredients with the oil, rest of the oil. Why we need to use the rest of the oil from the fish? Because we can give the food more tasty and more flavor. So we need to fry all the things. Until you like golden brown. So you can see all the ingredients already dry. After that guys, we need to pull all the sauce. We already mix. Pull all the sauce.
also guys you can add a little bit water uh, around 40 ml and you mix it after that guys pull all the fish inside the sauce and mix it Look like this guys, mix the fish with the sauce. This is how the fish look like guys. Smells so good. I can't wait to test the fish and already have my rice. I eat brown rice, so let me taste it. I will let you know how the taste feel like that, the flavor, okay? First, I will test the, the sauce, like from the fish with rice. Really good guys, you can try at home mm, the sauce, if you like ginger, it's kind of really strong flavor. Also, the sauce is a bit sweet and a little bit salty, but it's not really salty, like sweet. If you have, have um, sweet soy sauce, it's something like that, but this kind is different because it tastes like really delicious. After that, I will test the fish meat. It's really good, guys. You can taste it. You can try it at home. I can't stop to eat the food because this is my favorite. Hmm. Really good. All is done now. I will try the fish and the sauce is so gingery and also really sweet, not really salty. And the fish is really crispy outside and inside is really juicy. So guys, don't forget to try to cook it at home for your parent or for your partner or for your friends. You can try it at home. It's really easy. It's not really hard. And guys, I need to mention you before we close the cooking tutorials. I need to mention you guys. Don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel and like the video and give me a thumbs up. You also can write your comment. You can ask me anything. If I'm free, I will replay your comment as soon as possible. And see you again on my next video on my YouTube channel. See you again guys. Bye bye and have a good day.